Utilities have three core values, safety, reliability, and a reduced cost to you, the customer. Using those core values, we're gonna take a look at Truckee Donner Public Utility District in here in California, and we're gonna look at five key features in the new ArcGIS Network Management Solution to address those core values. So number one, modeling data in more detail. Taking a look at this circuit map, it's really interesting. Substations in general are kind of like a network inside a network, and maybe not so often represented in GIS. But here, we could select the substation, and in the attribute values, we could see all the equipment in it. What more, we can go into containment and see the features on a map. Now we can trace from our circuits through the substation down to the customer. Next item, alternative views. Schematics are important for engineers. Now we can build schematic maps directly from our GIS. We can edit, configure them to our best view, and even select and propagate that selection back to the GIS, a true geoschematic representation. Number three, you've asked us to improve quality control using validation and attribute rules. So now we can edit this substation, we can expand it, and as we adjust the size, we can automatically calculate acreage on the fly, populate it in. We could also have constraining rules that will enable us to keep us from building that substation too large. Another example is group and preset templates. And using these templates, we can build assemblies of equipment that are all connected with each other, that have the appropriate engineering spa uh, spacing and even sequencing for your facility IDs. Next, let's take a look at a neighborhood. So in this underground network, We've got a feeder that needs to be de-energized for our linemen to go do work. But before it is, we've got to make sure the switching order is proper for the switch. So we've checked to see that our, our neighbors are all online. So let's go ahead and look at the switch. Traditionally, it took three, four, maybe five switches and a couple of orders to be able to do this. Now with just one device, we can alter the flow of power and isolate just one of the feeders. That's information. Saranya, can you take the last one? Sure. Number five, utility network is not limited to the desktop. The functionality is now available beyond the desktop. For instance, using this targeted web application, an executive with no GIS background could easily trace the circuits in the network or perform the same downstream trace that we just did in the desktop. The services-driven architecture of the network puts the capabilities of our solution in the hands of the entire organization. We look forward to see how utilities and our partners utilize these items to meet their core business values. Thank you. Thank you.